Hello everybody, welcome to another day with me and Pastor Dele from London and uh, uh, we are talking about how do you uh, survive, how do you survive in a foreign land when you are just moving there and uh, many people have lost themselves, many people have lost their priorities just because they didn't have the nuggets and the, and the, and the secrets of survival in a foreign land. So you mentioned God mm -hmm. as number one yes. and number two, information. information yes. Um, I, when, when one gets into a foreign territory, you need information. Today, many people are in prison, not because they are criminals, but because they didn't get the right information. Today, many people are, are, have gone, have uh, got, gotten married to the wrong people for lack of information. Some people have joined gangs for lack of information. Or some people have wasted the, a better part of their life walking rather than getting information. For example, information about how about adding value. Um, I got to England years ago and I was I was working at McDonald's. I was a train station cleaner, cleaning to stations, and people will see me and be no I'm not nobody can believe it. Of course. Right. I, I, I decided to get information. How can I add my value? How can I better my, my, my life? And uh, that was when I uh, got information about how to become a lawyer. And I studied in England. And today, uh, with, with, with all humility, with all humility, there is hardly a city that I enter in the United Kingdom that someone doesn't recognize me. Why? because of information that I got about adding value. So people get into a foreign land, they, get, they have to get information, and they have to know God, they have to get information. When you get information, um, you have to get information about adding value. And, and I thank God there are some guys I met some years ago that, I, that came to the church, and I gave them information. Some of them are on, uh, earning on hundred thousand pounds a year. Now. You added value. To of course, I added value, but they came to the right place. Um, I see. You understand? Um, uh, I, I, I believe tomorrow I'll be talking about finding yourself in the right company because I iron sharpens iron. But today, the environment, environment, yes, the people that you move with. But today, I'm talking about, Learn to about yes, add value. Eh? Yes, you need to add value. Or go and get information that will add value. That to will you. add value to you. And then you become, yes, people may not like you because of your accent. They may not like you because of your color. They may not like you because, because of, of your, your ethnic country. origin yeah. or your country. But if you have what they want or what they need, they <laughs> will patronize you. Yeah, 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 I represent yeah. clients from over 50 countries. Um, despite your accent, I, despite your... I don't, uh, I don't think they all like me, but they like my knowledge. <laughs> they need it. They need, they need it. it. So, so, so they have to. Um, they, so, so the thing is that adding value is a key. When you get to a foreign land, you have to do everything within your power to... To add value to yourself. To add value to yourself, and then you can you add value to the life others. of others. Without that... And that person will struggle and 50 years in a foreign land will just be wasted. Unbelievable. Yeah. Well, thank you so much, Pastor Dele. Uh, and we will continue this talk tomorrow because I wonder if there are people you know, in like for example in England, who've been there like for 30, 40 years and have not made anything of it. But we'll talk about that in okay. the next program. Thank you.